exercise pinnacle, biggest RAF manoeuvre since the war, finds bombers being prepared on enemy aerodromes for daylight raids on Britain, in which pilots from many countries took part. After the crews receive final briefing, engines turn over and the bombers take off to rendezvous over the North Sea and then deliver saturation attacks on Britain's chief industrial centres. But on the coast, the Royal Observer Corps are ready, and as the bombers become visible targets, their height, speed and direction are reported back to Fighter Command HQ. Soon the signal scramble, relayed to fighter stations, sends pilots running to their planes to intercept the raiders. In this case, it's the famous American Ace of Spades squadron, equipped with Sabre jets, which recently took up operational duties in Britain to strengthen Western air defense. Meanwhile, back at control, the raiders are plotted across the country. Two, three, hostile, one, two, nine, three plus at four, zero. A British meteor jet squadron goes into action as another hostile force crosses the coast. The Meteor recently set up speed of climb records and now can be seen the value of their 40,000 feet ascent in three minutes. With this height advantage, they're able to deliver a successful attack upon a marauder. Thus, one more bomber fails to reach the target. First reports of Exercise Pinnacle, designed to test Britain's air defences, are encouraging, proving that our pilots are ready to win once again any future Battle of Britain.